Morena everyone, Michael Sharp here from Sharp Performing Arts. I would just like to share some poems with you, if I might, today. And I'm going to be doing a series of uh, short videos um, exploring Shel Silverstein's poems from the book Falling Up. These poems are really, really great if you want to um, extend on from doing tongue twisters to um, practice your articulation and your projection. Uh, before you might want to do any performance. These poems are really good for that. So here we go. Falling up. I tripped over my shoelace and I fell up, up to the rooftops, up over the town, up past the treetops, up over the mountains, up where the colours blend into the sounds. But it got me so dizzy. When I looked around, I got stick sick to my stomach and I threw down. illustration here. Plugging in. Peg plugged in her electric toothbrush. Mitch plugged in his steel guitar. Rick plugged in his CD player. Liz plugged in her VCR. Mum plugged in her electric blanket. Pop plugged in the TV fights. I plugged in the blow dryer. Hey, who turned out the lights? Complaining Jack. This morning, my old Jack in the Box popped out and wouldn't go back in the box. He cried, Hey, there's a tack in the box and it's cutting me through and through. There's also a crack in the box and I never find a snack in the box. And sometimes I hear a quack in the box because a duck lives in here too. Complain, complain is all he did. I finally had to close the lid. Awesome for um, exploring expression in the voice as well, colouring the voice um, when you're reading these poems. Makes them sound fun and engaging. Okay, I'll read two more. Sun Hat. Oh, what a sweet child is Hannah Hyde. Oh, how thoughtful, how, oh, how nice to buy a hat with a brim so wide. It gives shade to the frogs and the worms and the mice. Check out that hat. It's massive. And the last poem I'm going to read in this short video is called Snowball. I quite like this one. I made myself a snowball as perfect as could be. I thought I'd I could keep it as a pet and let it sleep with me. I made it some pajamas and a pillow for its head. Then last night it ran away, but first it wet the bed. <gasps> it's a funny one, isn't it? I hope you enjoyed those first few poems from Falling Up, and I'm gonna to continue to read some of these poems through a short series of videos that I hope you enjoy. Kaki everyone.